Hi everyone. So I have a kind of a weird announcement to make. Not sure if you're going to really care about this. It's very important to me. It's very exciting for me. But you may be able to help me and you may be able to get involved in some small way. Basically, for the entire month of August this year, I am going to be travelling around Europe which is really exciting. God, can you even see this? This is a big map. So you may not be able to see this very well, but I am going on a interrailing tour of Europe. So uh, basically that means I'm just getting trains all around Europe. I'm going to seven different cities from August the 6th to August like the 29th, from London all the way to Amsterdam, from Amsterdam to Berlin, from Berlin to Prague, then down to Vienna, then down to Milan, then to either Lyon or Marseille, haven't decided yet, and then back home. A month-long trip of Europe and it's going to be uh, fun it's gonna be interesting and more importantly I'm going to be taking some 360 cameras to do some tours to do some 360 content in all these cities because they're all amazing cities in their own right they all have so many amazing things to see and do I want to create a virtual tour for each of these cities similar to what I did for London um, go basically to some of the more interesting places to some of the more places well some places that you wouldn't necessarily think of that aren't necessarily the most touristy places. Obviously I'll do some of the touristy places as well. And I wanted to create this virtual tour of these cities so that people can get to know it and get to see what it's really like. Now my issue is that while I did this for London and it came out quite well, um, obviously I know London like the back of my hand, been here for five years, I know it well. However, I do not know Prague, Berlin, Amsterdam, Milan, who I don't know those like the back of my hand. So I need your help. One, to tell me where I should go. What should I film in 360? What should I show on these virtual tours of these cities because I want to show you the best places, the coolest places, the places that look amazing when you view it in a virtual reality headset and people are going to want to look at. Um, if you live in any of these cities, then please let me know where you think I should go, where you think I should film. And you know what, even if you're free, if you live in these cities and you want to meet up and you're into 360 cameras, 360 video, then um, I'm sure I can find some time. Hopefully, I can't promise, but um, yeah, it will be cool to meet up with people along the way. So yeah, that's basically it. A big European 360 adventure um, should be good. The other thing that I'm uh, thinking about or concerned about or not quite decided on is which cameras shall I take? I mean, I have quite a lot. So um, the last one I filmed, I filmed with the E360 because it shoots in 5K, 5.7K, looks very good once you edit it. Uh, I could just, I mean, it's quite small, so I, I could take this for the, like the still shots, doing some moving shots as well. So I want something that has stabilization because I mean, I can't take all of them. I can't walk around Europe travel around Europe with 17 cameras in my bag, it's just uh, stupid. Like I can only take really two cameras, I think, maybe three at a push, but I don't really wanna take, I'd rather just take two, one for video, one for photos. Help me decide, you tell me what you think I should take and I will think about it and make a decision. Also, also, after I get back from Europe, so open this giant map again, I'm going around Europe, like I say, from the 6th till the 28th or 29th, haven't actually decided when I'm coming back yet. Then after that, literally like two days later, I am flying all the way from London to New York. Get back on the 29th of August, on the 1st of September, I am flying to New York. Also, we'll be taking some cameras. Um, so if you're in New York, again, it will be cool to, for you to tell me or even show me if you can some really cool, interesting places that aren't necessarily like the tourist hotspots, but places that are really cool and that only guess someone who lives there would know about. I want to find these special places. So yeah, really looking forward to New York. So yeah, I guess that's it. Um, obviously throughout the whole month, I'll be sharing on Instagram, taking some photos and videos and sharing. But at the end of it all, I want to come back and have enough video to create seven separate VR tours that do these cities justice, that show the cool spots, yes, the tourist spots, the places we all know, but also some hidden treasures, some places that only locals will know about that are also awesome and I want to share these. So yeah, it'd be cool if you guys could help me out. That would be awesome. So very excited, Europe, gonna be great. And then New York, which will be awesome. So yeah, I will see you around. Bye.